Welcome to the TLX Just in Time, Quick Tutorials Just for GBC Faculty. My name is Ian Crane, I'm a professor and instructional designer in the TLX. We all know that first impressions count. That's why we strive to have a great first class. But how can we do that remotely? How do you create a positive and engaging learning environment in the first few weeks that builds a sense of community and engagement to keep motivation high through the challenging days ahead? A good place to start is by listening to our students. Here are three big things that students say they want most in their online experience. They want a positive and caring learning environment. They want connection and community. And they want clarity and relevance. What can you do to provide a caring and positive learning environment? Well, students want responsive faculty who are flexible and communicative. One way you can show that is to send a welcome message from your course. Students like the fact that you've reached out. You could create a welcome video or other fun way to introduce yourself. Students can also share their own welcome videos. Flipgrid is a great tool for this. Students want a positive and supportive learning environment that recognizes the challenges they face. This is a hard time. It's a hard time for everybody. So let the students know you're aware of the many stresses in their lives right now. You can also provide links to student supports at GBC, such as the COVID-19 information for current students. You can also consider being flexible with extended deadlines and possibly alternative assignments. You can acknowledge the time zone challenges faced by some of your students and be open to finding solutions for them. What can you do to provide connection and community? Students want a sense of community with people reaching out and staying connected. You could start by creating a welcome announcement, telling them how to engage with you and with the course. Students also want to practice online networking skills to help prepare them for their careers. You can highlight the ways you will encourage networking and community in your course. You can talk about the group work you may have, the shared activities, if you're using Microsoft Teams or forums, wikis, blogs, or social networking tools. Students also want easy networking. They want to be able to connect readily with you and the other students in the course. You can help with this by creating a group activity or discussion in the first class. Let the students begin to network and introduce themselves. You can have them complete an easy task together. What can you do to provide clarity and relevance? Students want to be engaged with the course. One of the ways you can do this is to share your enthusiasm about the course materials with them. You can showcase some of the highlights of the course or the career-related skills they will gain to help get your students engaged and motivated. Course outlines may cover some of this stuff, but let's face it, they're often pretty dry, and this is your chance to showcase the highlights of the course in your own words. Students want clearly communicated expectations. So you can talk about the graded assessments in the first class and direct them to a schedule of due dates. Students also want relevant course materials that are available and easy to find particularly information about assignments and tests. You can use our Blackboard course template or follow its suggestions for logical course navigation. And finally, it's a challenge for all of us, but we'll get through it. Stay safe, everyone, and have an awesome first week. This has been TLX Just In Time. Quick tutorials just for GBC faculty.